Baby, hold on. I want to go get something, okay? Baby. Babe. Babe. Uh, Ashley. 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 Ashley, wake up now, wake up, Ashley, Ashley, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, Ashley, Ashley, wake up now, this cannot be a prank, Ashley, Jesus, Ashley, 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 wake up now, Ashley, wake up, Ashley, 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 this cannot be a prank now, Ashley, Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. This cannot be happening. Ashley. Ashley. Christ, what am I going to do? Ashley. Ashley. Your sister, she's your. Ashley, your sister. Ashley, wake up now. Ashley, wake up, wake up. Ashley, wake up. Your sister is calling. She's calling. Ashley, 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 please wake up now. Don't die on me, please. Ash, Ashley, wake up, wake up. Ashley, wake, Ashley now. Wake up, wake up, please. What do I do? What do I do? Ashley, this can't be happening now. This. Hello? Um, pick up, pick up now, pick up. Yes, hello, Dr. Richard. Look, I need you to come to my house right now, please. It's urgent, please, please. Doctor, please, just come to my house. A friend of mine is, is just lying. He's just lying dead, he's unconscious. I don't know. I don't I don't know what to do. Doctor Richard, are you not listening to me? I said she's just lying dead. What I don't even know what happened to her. I don't I don't know. She's just here. I, I, did, I did not do anything to her. Yeah, uh, hello, Adi. Adi? Uh, yeah, how far now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Adi, please, I need you to come to my house right about now. It's very, very urgent. Adi, it's something I can't, I can't just say it over the phone now. Look, just come right away. I will explain everything to you. Please. Adi, look. Do you want to come by my house tomorrow and see that I'm dead? Eh? Adi? You want to come to my house tomorrow and see that I'm not, I'm not alive again? Adi, please just come to the house. No, 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 it's, it's urgent. I beg. Okay, 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 okay.
Thank you. 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 Thank we just got done making love. And, you know, I rested and I woke up. I tried to wake her. I was waking her, waking her. She was not responding. All of a sudden, she started to get cold. What are you talking about? I mean, I mean, Ashley is dead. What? Hey, guy, chill now. Which guy, you didn't want me? Which one is Ashley is dead? Are you serious? Are you kidding? What, what's, what's the meaning of that? Where is she? She's in my bedroom. Come, come let me just show you. Check now, check. Check for yourself. It's funny, but be like who they sleep now, bro. Wait, let me check. She's dead. Bro, she's dead. What happened now? What, 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 what happened? Didn't I tell you? I told you now. I told you that we, we made love now. After making love, we just slept a little bit. I wanted to just... Leave the bed to go get water. I've been shaking her. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. I don't understand what is happening. She's not responding. Just like that? Just like that now. Just like that. Can't you see? Who on earth is going to believe that you didn't do anything to this girl? I don't know. See, you need to calm down. Calm down, relax. See, take some chill pills, alright? See, these are people aware about this girl being here. I don't know. All I know is that her sister's been calling and. There's no way I could pick a call. I've been receiving different calls on her phone. I don't... I don't what am I going to do now? Chill now, calm down. Let me think. Calm down now. Switched off. But she barely turns on her phone. I have this feeling that something is wrong with her. Should we declare her missing already? No. It hasn't gotten to that. Maybe she's with one of her friends. What friend would she be without she would turn off her phone? Look, let's not panic yet. Okay? Who was the last person she was with today? Um, her boyfriend came in this morning and they left together. Which is why I said we shouldn't bother looking for her just yet. You know today is her birthday. Look, it's late. Let's go to bed. You mean Jeff? Yes. If something is wrong, definitely wrong somewhere. What could be possibly wrong? Hmm? Today is her birthday, and she could be with her boyfriend in an easy tight hotel, probably having hot sex, and you're here worrying yourself to death. Come on, it's late. Let's go to bed. No, I can't find, can't find Jeff's number here. Look, look. I'm going to bed. All right, and I advise you to do the same, okay? But why? Why will you switch off your phone? Ashley, stop doing this to me now. You know how worried I can be when... Sorry? Just bring Chovel and Digga from your house. Wait us for your junction. We'll go come pick you like this. 
Oh boy, I, I don't have time to explain. Just do it and I tell you. Kasala, don't boss. I did Jeff, please. All right, no wala. Chapali, chapali. I was speaking with Sonny. I told him to bring Choyal and Dika. And he told me he also knows an empty space of land. So bring it in. I don't understand them. Um, what are we doing with Shovel? Bury her, of course. Adi! Are you out of your mind? Bury who? See, Jeff, you need to relax. We don't have any other option right now. Bury in this case, the only option we got. Are you okay? How can you suggest such a thing? Bury, bury what? Yes, now. See. No amount of thing we are going to do tonight will bring this girl back to life. Hey. We need to do this thing right now. Bury this girl once and for all. Clear every trace of this girl in this house for good. Hey, so we will we, we, we not go to jail. Wait, so if these girls people come asking of her and don't see her cops, we are doing all this because we want to clear our name from going to jail. Exactly. They will declare missing. Yes now, bro, come on. Back up now. I'm sorry, I don't mind to your idea. Jeff! It's gonna pull you. You had a covenant never to lay with any man, but you broke it. M me? I, 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 I never entered any covenant. Have you ever wondered why you always pass out whenever you plan to lay with a man? You are not in a position to decide what is fair or not. You will remain here until your case is judged and concluded. My case? Please wake up now. <sighs> Babe. <sighs> Look, Ashley, I promise I would never do anything to hurt you. Please, just, just wake up. Eh, please, no, you can't, you can't just die on me like this. Please. They're saying they want to bury you, and I don't want that. Eh, please, just, just wake up. I can't, I can't bury you now. I can't, I can't just watch them bury you. Please, just wake up, wake up, please, Ashley.
Chef. Class. Relax, relax. Listen to me. See, we need to cut her into pieces and shove her into this bag. Adi? For proper burial. Uh, hey, Adi, are, are you a ritualist? Adi, oh, oh, hey, hey. Adi, what kind of woman are you? Relax, bro. How can we carry this whole body inside this bag? Wait, without cutting it? Without cutting it? Yes, now. Adi, you're a ritualist. You're a wicked person. You want to cut? Adi? Adi, please let us carry this body out of this side into my car. What's more of this? Are you sure? Let's, let's cut this body now into pieces. Adi. Cut it into pieces. Do you have mind, though? Cut it into pieces. Yes, now, bro. Adi, you're a ritualist. My friend, my friend, drop this, drop this cutlass, drop. Let's carry this body. Let's carry it. God knows I try to help you. Try to, try to, try to help So if they leave you now, you start cutting somebody's side. You don't want to. Let's cut. Evil spirits. Let's carry it. The way that is you. Jeff, are you sure? Let's, we can cut her. What's up? Let's go bury this girl now. Eh? I've, I've always told you this girl is a bad luck. Oh, bad luck! Oh, Adi, calm down. Huh? Look, look, this, this is not what you're saying right now. This is not the right time for this. See, burying her is the only option we got. I'm telling you, bro. Let's come bury her. What do I tell her people? Her people? No, what do I tell her brother or her sister when they come looking for her tomorrow? What would I tell them? You tell them you don't know where the girl is. You think it's that simple? And they will believe me. I don't know where the girl is. And they will believe me. See, Jeff, that girl is getting cold. Human beings, when they die, immediately they start decaying. Do you get my point? So we need to bury that girl before tomorrow morning. You're there, they check, check, they do like, but I don't understand you. You need to think fast. So if not, bro, I'm leaving you. I'm leaving this whole case. Uh -uh. Adi. You're leaving? Yes, now. No, you can't leave me now. I thought we were in this together. How will you leave me? In this together? Jeff, you were busy enjoying this girl yesterday. You were enjoying her yesterday before this whole case come up. And when you know you have problem, you called me. And I said to, us to support you because you're my friend. But this whole thing is shocking me. Bro, it's shocking me now. Come on. You're putting me in a tight corner. Let's go bury this girl. I don't understand. You need to think fast, though. So please, where, 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 should, where should we pass? Wait, wait, hold on. I don't want you to pass this place. Police, they did this place away. Eh? Police? Yes, so I don't, I don't get body for a while. I'm going to just pass this side. Okay. Pass the side. Police, did that side. police did that. Okay, okay, move past, move past. Yeah. 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 Sonny? Uh-huh. How far that piece of land where you tell me? Which side is it? No, just they go front. They, they land. Front, they, they, they front, they front, yes. We we'll just do this thing, come on, girl, this night. I'm not gay, but if you want to You see that space, Abby? Yeah, this place. Uh, that space, that space. So, now, the place with this. You 
上去，咁上去。阿爹，阿爹，姐，阿爹，姐，索尼，姐，我操！ Look, I changed my mind. I changed my mind. We can't, we can't just break out like that. I cannot deny knowing that. I'm not knowing about that, I'm aware about now. I can't deny that. Adi, Shebe, I don't think say this guy in your head. He, he had no correct at all. What kind of sense with this one guy, man, now? Uto, okay, this is not dead body. Where will bury him? The only thing we have to do for this guy now is to bury him. Where will go rush now and bury him? See, I'm not burying him, that's fine. Now. Okay, shut up! Shut up! You just made me the sofa, the sofa throughout today. Just because of this particular dead, dead person. What's, what's your problem now? What's your problem? Eh? You know, I do all this because I won't cover your mother's kids. You did it and suffer me. See, if you're not ready to bury this guy, Sonny, let's get the fuck out of here. What's wrong with this guy? Go do it yourself. Adi, Adi, Sonny, Sonny. Adi. Still here? Yes. Uh, in any lock reaching her yet? No. What is time now? It's past midnight. Oh, okay. Did you try her friend, Ernestina? Yes, I tried her, but her number isn't going through. Her number is not going through. What's going on? What about her boyfriend? I told you I don't have his number in my phone. It's oh. not here. Yeah. Look. You need to calm down. Let's wait till morning. For now, we sleep. What are you saying? I should go to bed? When I don't know the whereabouts of my sister? Look, being awake is not going to bring her home. All right? Let's go to bed, sleep, reset, and then we'll wake up with a better decision to make tomorrow morning. Jennifer. Just let me be, please. Fine. Good night. Jennifer. Ashley. Ashley, why? Why are you doing this to me? Why don't you just wake up? You were not sick. No sign of illness or something. Eh? Please now, just wake up. Do you want me to go to jail? Ashley, please. What am I going to say? What am I going to explain to people? Just, just wake up now, please. Could you just stay there and watch me go through this pain? I beg you, please now. Uh, where's my sister? Where is my sis? That is the question. Why is she? Um, look guys, I promise you it's not as if I did anything to hurt her. What are you talking about? Why is she? Um, she's in the bedroom. She's She's 
Fred! I think he ran away. I left his car here. So, Jeff killed my sister and ran away. Funny. I swear, I'm going to kill him. So, what do we do now? We have to go report to the police. You want us to leave her alone here? What do you want me to do? What do you want us to do? She is already dead. Did you not see her? We need to report to the police before this guy leaves this city. Now you're right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. You are very stupid. We told you to bury this guy yesterday night. You refused. Now their family have found out. What are you going to do? Look, as I speak to you, I'm on my way to the police station. Right? You're on your way to the police station and say what? To tell them what happened now. Uh, to tell them everything has happened. Jeff. You're very, very stupid. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Kai. So, you are not telling me that you left those guys in your house. Yes, I did. What do you expect me to do? To stay there? See, if you want to go to the police station, go and submit yourself to them. Do you understand? Before the family calls first. But one thing is, whatever thing you are doing, don't get me and Sonny involved. I'm telling you. Don't get us involved. Man, no, I don't clear you my own belly. My mind no there. Ah. Yeah. What are you talking about? Look, nobody will believe you didn't kill her. And there is certainly no way I can prove that. <sighs> Jeff, sincerely, you're my friend. But there is a limit I can help you. I just explained everything to you. I just explained what happened. <sighs> okay. You said you left her in your house with the brother and sister. Yeah, 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 I did. We have to go to your house now. Ma. What Miss Jennifer is here. She wants to see you. It's a murder case. It, that's, oh. that's a sister. You are oh, here? So this is where you are, eh? This is where you are after killing my sister. Hey, calm down. Please, you're in my office. GPO, this man here killed my sister. He used her for money to show us. That, that, that's, that's obviously a lie. Ah. But you have to calm down. Please, GPO, you need to come with us. GPO, this man here murdered my sister. He murdered her. I even have the evidence here. Let me have that food. That is the food. Give it to me. You need to come with us. Look at my sister. It's okay. It's okay. Oh. See? Let's go.
Where is my sister? Where? Where is my sister? What are you doing? I, I left, I left, I left, I left you both with her now. TPO, look, I left her here with them. What are you saying? What is going on here? Ma'am, she was right here when we left the house for the station. What is this? Where is my sister? Officer, this man here killed my sister. I, I, left, I left her here with both of them. I'm, I'm sorry, we cannot continue with this case. We have to find the body before there could be a case. What if she has woken up and gone home? Maybe we should go home and check. I think Ashley is dead for real. Did you not see how cold she was? Yeah, I, I saw it. But the DPO said there cannot be a case without a body. So what do we do? With or without body. Jeff must tell me why he killed my sister. Or what he did to her. I must get to the root of this. I won't stop. I think it is ideal that we go home and check. Let the police do their investigation. Ashley! 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 I believe Jeff has Ashley's body. What makes you think so? I don't know. I don't know, but that's what my God is, is telling me. That's what I think. I have this feeling that Ashley is dead for real. Oh, come on. Jeff is not what you think he is. She can't be dead. Just, just try calling her again, please. Her number is that. I've tried. Her number is not connected. It's not going through. This thing says switched off. I don't even know what to think. I don't even know what to believe. I don't know what's going on. Oh, God. Ashley, not, not, not like this. Like this. Not like this. Not like this. It's okay. It's okay. We'll find her. Jeff, you have to tell me the whole truth. If I do not know the truth, I can't help you. I already explained these things to you. We got done making love. We slept a little while. I wanted to just stand up to get water. I tried waking her and I realized she was not responding. And I had to feel her body and notice she was getting cold. I got, I got pretty scared. I called a doctor friend of mine. And he said he couldn't make it because it was pretty late. You should have taken her to any nearby hospital. You are in for a big shit, Jeff. There is no way her sister will not press charges against you if her body is found. But I did not kill her. I'm not sure of that. And there is certainly no way the courts will not convict you of murder. I left both of them in the house. So how then did her body get missing? Who 
is has access to your house? Nobody. Nobody has access to my house. I don't know why I have this feeling like they're trying to free me up for something. Why? Jeff. Oh. So they let you go? Yeah, my lawyer bailed me. But I was asked not to leave town for the meantime because they possibly know that I have nothing to do with the disappearance of her body. So what, what are you telling me? That the body just disappeared from your room? Just like that? Look, this whole thing feels mysterious to me. I left her with her sister and her brother. I ran to both of you before I went to the police station, so I know nothing about the disappearance of her body. So what are they playing at? Because they possibly know where that body is. Are they what are you saying? What if they don't know? Eh? Then where is the body? Look, guys, look, I've had the longest day. Like I've been up since morning. I just want to get to my house and rest. Eh? I wish I could just sleep and wake up and this whole thing is a dream. Anyways, thank you guys. Eh? See you guys. Now nah, about the may or I just did grand do nine day important for us. I don't understand this guy. I want you to understand. Asking the same question. I left you and your brother in this house with Ashley. Ran to the police station to report the incident. And now you're asking me where is your sister? Look, if you have nothing to say about this thing, please just get out of my house. Jeff, did you use my sister for money rituals? I did do kill your sister, Jennifer. Don't you get it? We only made love and she passed away. I tried every possible means to revive her, but she, she did not wake up. You tried every possible means. What means did you try? How did you do it? And then let me ask you, what happened to the hospital? What happened to the doctor? What happened to calling us? Us? You don't have my number anymore? What she passed out? What did you do? What effort did you make? You can't answer me. Let me tell you something. I will make sure you rot in jail for killing my sister. I will make sure you don't walk freely on the road for this that you just did. Jennifer, what are you saying? I called a doctor friend of mine. I called him by past 2 a.m. but he said he couldn't come. What is this thing you're threatening me with a case for going to jail? Look, I was granted bail. Yes, and I'm not leaving town. Okay. I think if you want us to find your sister, let's work together. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe she's not even dead or something. Pray. Pray that she is not dead. Because if she is, I will make sure that you are hanged for her death. Excuse me. We are the things here. Eh? If you enter trouble very soon, oh. what do you mean by trouble? How? Ah, ah. So you know, no, see, police, we can't catch us because of what happened. Because we are accomplice. Come on, we didn't kill the girl. Jeff did. <laughs> Jeff did now. Bro, it's as it is. You don't need to look up to the word accomplice. I'm telling you. See, all the same, I don't think Jeff will rat us out. Because if he does, he will give himself down to the police. <laughs> Baba, I just they laugh you. Bro, you need to leave town tomorrow morning, you know, because me I they leave. Because this guy, if you go open mouth anyhow, like, you are no pata for that police station. These guys go just catch up with us. Oh. Me I they work out. Sonny, I'm thinking the brother and the sister knows the whereabouts of that corpse. What are you even saying? How can they even go and hide their own sister's corpse? Yes, yes now to set Jeff up. Oh, that story is not clear. You look like. I'm telling you, I'm, I'm having this feeling. 
They know something. They know something. No clear at all. I just they pity that my guy. Sorry. They know something. This whole thing is not it is so strange to me. Oh my pity that young guy. But me at the job, I don't tell you. You better work out. Tomorrow morning, me, I don't work out. I, I need to I need to I need to talk to Jeff. I need to talk to Jeff. I need to talk to Jeff. I told the police nothing. Okay? Are you sure? Bro, calm down. Calm down. I told the police nothing. Okay? Just relax. Are you sure? You're not under arrest, are you? You're not. See, Jeff, whatever you need to do to remove my name from this, do it. I need to travel. If you're not sure you can take my name out of it, I will travel. I need to travel, please. Look, I'm sorry I caught you involved in the first place, okay? But trust me, it's not in my intention to mention your name or say anything that you did anything or something. Besides, even if your name comes up, you can always deny it. Deny it? Don't mention my name, so I will see no reasons to deny it. Bro, what are you going to do? Well, my lawyers said I should not do anything or say anything to anyone. I'm just going to stick to it. My family will be worried. They will be calling. Well, I'm waiting for them. Let them bring it up. I ask again. Where is she? Where did you hide that body? What did you do with that girl? What else do you want me to tell you? Like I said earlier, I left her with her brother and sister. After I met you in the earlier, earlier hours of the day, I went to the police station. What else do you want me to tell you? What else do you, do you guys need me to say? Bro, Sonny thinks you're lying. He believes you know the whereabouts of that body and you hide it and dispose it the way you want it. Well, as you can see, what I'm saying is the truth. I have nothing to hide. Guy, this, this whole thing is just so, so strange to me. To be a boss, it is cut on my head. She's gone, but her essence still lie with him. I don't understand. She's not supposed to live with any man. I believe this has happened before. She always planned to live with her boyfriend on her birthday. But this was not planned. That is why she passed out during the sex. So, where is she now? In the Marine Kingdom, inside the prison. Eh? Marine Kingdom? Prison? Why? She made a covenant before she came into this world that she's not going to live with any man till after her marriage. They are protecting her. That is why they always blank her out whenever she wants to make love. So, what happens now? It's either they keep her there forever, or they strip her all of her entitlement. You have to stop fighting her boyfriend. So tell me, when last did this happen? Birthday girl. 
this one you are sleeping. I hope you've not forgotten your appointment with Jeff today. Ashley. But I wake up. Now you like sleeping. Ashley. Ashley. Before you sleep. Ashley. Wake up. You have appointment with Jeff today, Ashley. Okay? Wake up. Ashley. 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 I don't understand. Ashley. Are you okay? Ashley. Ashley. Wake up! Ashley! What's going on? Mike! Oh my God. Mike! Somebody help! Mike! What? Can, you, can you just hear me? Can you hear me? What is I don't know what is wrong with her. She can't wake up. I don't know what's wrong. Find out. Ashley. Ashley can't wake up. She's cold. She's what? She's cold. Come on, come on, come on. Ashley! Oh my God. Please, please, please. Oh my God. Let's go. Is she okay? Um, Jennifer, I'm sorry. She's dead on arrival. What? What? Just like that? What did I say? Doctor. Now what happened? Just come. come. come, come. Ashley! You see, we carried out comprehensive tests on your sister, but found nothing. All her vital organs work perfectly as if nothing happened to her. And this is strange. As a medical doctor, I am confused. Honestly, I'm confused on what must have led to her death in the first place. Doctor, I'm confused as well. Well, we thank God she's better now. Yeah. Thank you very much, too. It's all right. Thank you, sir. It's all right. Limited. All right. Thank you. And since after then, it has happened twice again. The man she's dating doesn't know about this. And I prefer he doesn't know. Because he must be blamed for killing my sister. You know that's not true. He loves your sister. He ruined her life. That is what he did. And I will make sure that he is dealt with severely. My sister's body is nowhere to be found till now. It's possible. All you need to do now is to team up with him 
and look for your sister's body before it's too late. Stop fighting him. If you'll be able to recover your sister's body, I can bring her back from the marine world before the time is up. How long do we have? Twelve hours more. What does she mean by her uh, essence still lies within? Is she referring to her corpse or what? She said that uh, Ashley belongs to some marine kingdom. And that she is in prison over there. How true is this? I don't even know what to believe and what not to believe in this whole thing. The woman did not tell me where her body is. She also said that Jeff loves her so much that he can't possibly hurt her. And he couldn't take her to the hospital when, when she passed out. Did you get? Eh? I don't even know if the police will solve this case as soon as possible. With the way the whole thing is going. I think we need to start keeping an eye on Jeff henceforth. Moreover, it doesn't usually take this long before she wakes up. So why now? It's been 12 hours now, and... and... The, 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 the woman also said that, that, my, that they might not release her from the Marine Kingdom because they want her never to sleep with any man until she gets married. What? Wait. Does it mean that she might actually die for you? understand how you feel. Just take things easy. Now you don't need to start talking to people about what has happened. I understand. And who and who have you spoken to about this issue? Uh, just you and a um, couple of friends, although I, I trust them, Jimmy. They're my close friends. You trust them? You don't need to trust anyone else except me. For whatever you say to them can be used against you in the court of law. So you need to take things gradually. Now, I need you to give me a full, consigned statement regarding this issue. Everything you know, just tell me. If you have witnesses, you can bring them to me. But I need you to go in detail what happened earlier today. How come? How come? How? 
Glaubst du? How fast can you pay one million naira before I send this cup to the police with your fingerprints all over it? Hello? 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 sounded like this on the phone was last night and I came to this your house and I found a copy of your bedroom. So what is it this time around? Adi, Adi, calm down. Okay. I just need to show you something. Look. What is this? It's a corpse now. Someone sent it to me. Then call the line now. Call the line. That's what I've been trying to do since and it's not connecting. The last, I don't know. The last thing they were talking about was sending money or something like that. Bro, then go to the police station. Go to the police station now. Yes, your, your, your police station, Abu. You're right. I need 5 million naira in the next 4 hours or I will bury your sister and she will never wake up again. Um, 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 uh, hello? What? Oh my god, what's this? What is it? Why are you looking like that? Look at and the next minute this same person called me that he need five million naira from us in the next four hours or he will bury Ashley's body and we'll never see her again. We need to go to the police. He, he also said that if we go to the police that we will never hear from him again and we'll never see Ashley's body again. That's nonsense. Nonsense. Look, we are going to the police because it is the right thing to do. Oh my God. That voice. That voice sounded so familiar. I'm trying to figure it out. How do you mean? Look, I am going to the police station, all right? Whoever it is is watching you, he's not watching me. Okay? My God. The voice. Five million naira. Oh, I bury. Who's who is this? God, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Oh. So someone took away your body and now he's asking for a ransom. Uh, that is what he appears to look like. Who else knows about the both of you? Uh, just my, my friends and her family. Your friends? What are their names and where do they live? Uh, DPO. Look, I'm sure my friends, they know nothing about this. Jeff, as it stands now, everybody who knows about the both of you is a suspect.
The person is demanding five million naira in the next four hours, or else he will bury her. And if my sister is buried, I'm afraid she might never wake up again. Wait, I don't understand. What do you mean by she might never wake up again? Mike, is there something you're hiding from us? No, ma. Look, what's important here is that we'll find a way to track down who has my sister's body. Well, you made a statement, so I need to understand what you mean by that. What do you mean by she might never wake up again? Mike, if you do not explain to me what you just said now, I will have to assume you and your sister are the reason why the body is missing. Okay, fine. Fine. This is actually not the first time my sister is dying. Yes. It has happened before. Usually, she passes out and then wakes up in not less than 24 hours or thereabouts. What? What, what, what? I don't understand. How come I don't know about this? How come she has never said anything of this nature to me? And how come here your sister kept this for me and accused me of murder? Jeff, our fear is that she might not come back to life again. And, and you are not entirely innocent in all, in all of this. You have to be blamed. What are you saying? Oh, you should have called us or, or, or taken her to, to a hospital. What do you mean I should have called? Do you know how scared I was? I was scared. Anyway, DPO, now that you know the truth, what do we do? Jeff, we will start with your friends and every other person that knows that she dies and wake up. Who is trying to get back at me? I think I know this voice, but I can't place it. God, please help me. I don't want Ashley to die. Jennifer, I should get you arrested for keeping the truth away from me. What truth? The truth that your sister always dies and wakes up every time. I'm sorry, sis. It just came out. But that's not what's important now. What's important is that we team up and look for Ashley before it's too late. Team up with who? With Jeff? Yes. It is important at this time that we work together to find whoever has her body. The person who needs the ransom. I think I know that voice. I've been trying to place it. Um, Jennifer, Mike, I will want to know who and who knows about our health condition. Who you guys may have offended and who might want to hurt her or any of you. But first, I will bring in Jeff's friends for questioning. Dipi, that's a good point. You do that, right? You do that. Are they right? That's the name. Yes, ma'am. I just want you to tell me the truth. If you do not speak up, I will lock you up. Do you know Ashley, Jeff's girlfriend? I don't know. I don't I don't know anybody called Ashley. Really? Yes. Lock him up. Ah, 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 I know, I know, I know, I know Ashley, I know Ashley. She she's I know, I know her, yes. I'm I'm sorry, she's Jeff's 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 girlfriend. She's Jeff's girlfriend. I know her, I know her very well. I am not here to joke with you. One more lies from you and I will lock you up. Or I will take you to the torture room to get the real truth from you. 
You know she's dead, right? Good one. So tell me, where is her body? What these questions you are asking me? I don't know. Jeff told me that the body was missing. I don't know. I was the one that personally told Jeff to come and report this case to the police. Yes. What and what did Jeff tell you? He called me on the phone and said the girl is dead and I went to his house. I had to call my friend Sonny to bring out shovel and digger so that we can bury her that night. But on getting there, Jeff changed his mind. Out of anger, we have to leave him there with the cops. Were you there when she died? I was not there. Jeff called me on the phone. Were you also there when he called the doctor? I wasn't there. He called me on the phone and he told me he called Dr. Richard. And he said Dr. Richard could not make it that night because it's already too late. And Dr. Richard advised him to take her to a nearby hospital. From there, I don't know what happened. I don't know. What do you do for a living? Nothing. We don't, we don't have a job. Nothing? We don't have a job. I see. So that was why you took away her body. And now you are demanding for a ransom of five million naira. Ah, five million! Quiet, quiet! Hey, hey. Five million for me, You just said five million naira, and I don't, I don't know now. You are not telling me the truth. See, I'm telling you, listen, check my heart, open up, tell her, open up. I don't know, I don't know. Ma, he knows where the body is. I'm very ah. sorry about that. Ah, okay. I don't know. I don't see madam. I don't. Yeah. I'm, I'm Steve, lock him up. Ah, 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 Jeff, I am your friend, but I don't know why you, you lied to me. I did not lie to you. How come you never told me about how you planned to bury her the night she died in your house? How you and your friends took her out, dug a grave and almost buried her? I feel that part was not necessary. You have to tell me the whole truth. I decide which part is not necessary. I'm sorry. <sighs> I think we need to track this number. It's of no use. He's always changing his number. I was, I've also tried calling. I can't even text him back. What is it, Jennifer? What is it? This is no longer funny. Whoever that is doing this knows us so well. Look, I need to show this to the DP.
There is one more person that knows about her issue that we have not spoken to. Who? The doctor. Which of the doctors? His name is Dr. Richards. Dr. Richard? Yes. Dr. Richard is my friend. Dr. Richard is the same doctor I said I called the same night and he said he couldn't make it. That I was going to come in the morning. Did he later come in the morning? No, he, he didn't. Instead, it was Mike and his sister. Let's go and see him. I am a detective with the police headquarters, and I'm here to ask you a few questions. Oh, okay, that's fine. Uh, let's go into my office then. Uh, no, 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 don't worry. I'm okay. Okay. All right, go, go ahead. There is a missing person, but first, I want to know if one Jeff called you last night about his girlfriend who is unconscious, and I want to know exactly what you both talked about. May I ask if there's a problem? Yes, his girlfriend is missing. Oh, I, I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. Jeff is actually my friend. And he called me late last night that his girlfriend is unconscious, that I should come around to assist and help revive her. But I couldn't go because it was so late. So I also suggested to him that he should take her to a nearby hospital. So did you tell him you would come around in the morning? Yes, I, I did say that. OK. Did you later go there in the morning? So, when you discovered there was no one at home, did you call him? Yes, I did, but he wasn't taking his calls. Okay. Thank you very much for your help, Dr. Richard. I'll get back to you. My pleasure. Thank you. Sleep, my love. I truly love you. I love you with all my heart. But you refuse to see it. Don't wake up yet. I am not done with you. I know you are in there. Your body is still warm. That means you have life. Just two more hours and I will be done with you. 
then you can wake up anytime you like. The doctor was the only man who visited that house in the absence of any other person. What if he enters the house and took the body? What if he is lying? Hello? You couldn't track the line? Another person's phone number. I'm sure it must be a stolen phone number. Okay, um, you know what? Send me the whole details. Yes, I need to send it to Abuja immediately for them to track that number. Thank you. Not over yet, at least we still have two hours. Please. Who is doing this to us? Who is doing this to us? Who? I don't know. Right? I, I have no idea. But what if it's someone she had issues with that we don't know? Someone? Yes. Ashley, what is it? Sis, some men are useless. Imagine Dr. Richard asking me out and even threatening to end my relationship. Dr. Richard did what? Okay, he asked me to date him. I told him I'm with Jeff. He now asked me if Jeff is aware of my condition, I mean my dying and waking up. I told him no, but I will tell him with time. Okay. Do you know that this man threatened to expose me if I don't sleep with him, if I don't give him one night? Can you imagine that? Richard said that? Yes. I never knew Dr. Richard was this, was this vile, he's a wicked man. I'm so disappointed, I, I never knew he was like this. So, Richard wants to blackmail you because you refused him? Yes. Yes! I'm so, I'm so disappointed, I'm so angry! It's okay, don't worry. I will handle it. Okay, sis. So upset. Doctor! Doctor Richard! He has Ashley's body! Yes! Yes! Okay. He said he went to Jeff's house. Yes. Yes, look at it. He went to Jeff's house. Nobody was around. He met Ashley's body. And he took it. Jeff's house to the police station. Jeff first left the police station. We left the police station, left her there. 
Dr. Richard went there. Nobody was around. It was just her body. He took it. We need to call the pill. We need to do that. Jennifer, we need to be sure first. Okay? We need to be sure. Very sure. What do you want us to be sure about? What is this with me? Are you not seeing what I'm seeing? He went there. Look, he said he went there, right? Yes. Yes, he went there. And nobody was there. What just the body on the, and he took the body. Is it possible that, that Ashley disappeared? Yeah. I want to know if Richard called this morning before or after you came to my office. Richard did not call me. Check your phone to be sure. Hold on, please. No, he did not call me. Neither am I seeing any missed call. Okay. All right, all right, thank you. Thank you very much. Yes. I think doctor has my sister. Dr. Richard? Yes. <laughs> that's, that's impossible. That's not possible. Mm -mm. It's possible. There was a time doctor asked my sister out, according to her, and she refused. And he was threatening her that he was going to tell you about her constant sudden blackout if she refused to have one night stand with him. What? I mean, come to think of it, what if he actually entered your house when he came this morning? I mean, what if he entered, saw her, and then took her with him? You know, that could be possible. Because the DPO just called to confirm if Dr. Richard called me before or after I came to the station to make the report. But I just told her no. Wait a minute. Wow. It feels so good having you at last. Even if you're still dead, or should I say half dead. It doesn't matter to me anymore. If you had agreed, I would have taken good care of you more than Jeff. Thank you. See, I... I love you, and I will do anything for you. Well, um, thanks for the love, but I believe you know about Jeff and I. Yes, I, I, I know. But to me, it doesn't matter. It matters to me. Oh, really? Yes. Does he know about your condition? I mean, that you always die and wake up with. No, but I'll tell him. What if I tell him now? Yes, do you think the relationship will be over? I know you won't tell him. Of course I will not tell him. That is, if we have one night out. Like one night stand. Go to hell, Dr. Richard. Go to Ashley. hell! Ashley. Ashley. Really? I should go to hell. <laughs> it doesn't matter now. In few hours, I will go out and dump you somewhere.
time for you to go home. You have been forgiven because of love. For you are no longer a member of this holy kingdom. And we will not protect or give you our blessings. As long as you live on earth, you are your own. Calm down, okay? You are in my guest room in my house. Why? Who brought me here? What am I doing here? Hey, hey, hey calm down. Listen, you, you must sit down back on the bed, okay? No, it's, it's okay. I, I, it's I okay. need to call Jeff. I, I, I need to call Jeff. I miss Jeff. It's okay, yeah. Jeff is fine, okay? Listen, you died as usual, but this time you couldn't wake up. This is about 16 hours now. So everybody thought you were not going to wake up again. I, I, I need to call Jeff and my sister. It, it, it's all right. It's all right. I, I, I will make the call myself, okay? Calm down. I'll call them and tell them that you are weak. All right? It's okay. It's okay. Um, 
I guess you must be hungry now. Let me go get you something to eat. Okay? Yeah, just just relax. I'll get you something. I'll be right back, okay? Where's my sister? No, 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 don't do that. Where is you looking for my sister? Why are you asking me? I don't know. Where is my sister? Madam, calm down. Allow me to do my job. Dr. Richard, you are a suspect in the disappearance of Ashley. You were the only one who visited her house while others were away. It is possible you moved the body. Wait, I, 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 do you want to arrest me because you think I moved the body? You have to come with me to the station. You are a suspect. Yes. But, but, but wait, Richard. Richard, you're my friend. Richard, you told the DPO that you called me, whereas you'd never called me. If you came to my house and you did not see me, you should have called me if you had nothing up your sleeves, Richard. Um, Jeff, listen, I, I, I called you, but your number was not connecting. That was not what you told me. Come on, let's go to the station. Whoa, Get in. Yeah, move, move. Move. I call my lawyer first. Move! 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 Doctor! Dr. Richard! Dr. Richard! your lawyer is out of town. Dr. Richard, why did you move the body? I did not see or move the body of Ashley. I know the both of you had history and you threatened to tell her boyfriend about her health condition if she refused to have a night stand with you. That was then. She refused, and I let it go. What type of a doctor are you, betraying your patient's confidence? That is not why you arrested me. You must let me go. I have so many patients I need to attend to. And besides, you do not have any evidence that I moved the body out of that house. Richard, I may not have the evidence I need, but I know you've been the one calling and texting for a ransom before you could release her body. Huh. Police are always very funny people. So it has suddenly moved from moving her body to demanding for ransom. I am the one handling this case and not my boys. And you know, I do not fear to solve any crime when I take it personal. <sighs> All right. I will say good luck to that. As for me, I do not have a hand in the disappearance of Ashley. You can go. Thank you.
I let him go because we do not have enough evidence to arrest him. Nibiru, you, you did what? How could you? How could you let that guy... That guy has my sister. Um, DPO. So what do we do now? Well, we just have to wait till the time is up. And tell the person we have the money to pay. We'll pick it up from there. DPO, you shouldn't have let him go. You should have kept him for hours. Taking his phone and just waited to see if a call or text will come in. What is that? Richard is the one doing this. Let me see. We need to get the search warrants to search his house. Don't worry, I'll get it ready in the GP. She was 
here? Yes. So that she bastard kept my sister here. She was it scared. seems she escaped. Escaped? Yes. The door was closed for Now, immediately! Now! Do not move an inch! I say drop her now! I, I, I can explain this. I told you, I do not fail to solve a crime when I take it personal. Anything you say or do will be used against you in the court of law. Let's move. Move! Now! Let's leave. Let's move. Is, is, she, is she pretty? No, she's not. So we, need, we need to take her to the hospital. Please, please, please. I tried what I lost you. I was so scared to my bone. Because I didn't know what to do. I didn't know if I should return your body to your people. If I should bury you. Like, I was literally scared. <laughs> well, I'm lucky you did not bury me. Otherwise, I won't be standing here with you right now. <laughs> I know. I know. I could imagine. The crazy experience. Mm. Mm. But it's a good thing you're here right now. Good news. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, the truth is, um, I've been with the marine world for a long time now, and I thought there was no escaping. I used to visit and return until I did something that ends me a serious punishment, and I stayed longer before I could wake up. As it stands now, I have been rejected. I can't go back again. I've been forbidden, so. So, um, I guess that's the good news. Yes, to you, me, and my family. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Um, look. You know, I don't know if I should be scared, but it's a good thing you're back here. And... <laughs> I want to walk down the aisle with you. I don't know if you would agree to walk that walk with me. Of course, babe. How can I do that? I love you a lot. I love you so much. I love you.
It's lonely at the night I didn't know what happened oh. It's lonely at the night I didn't know what happened It's story too long ago Whoa, 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 what could I explain? Cause it's story too long ago How could I explain oh, why it matter too long ago? It's lonely on the night On the night Everything seems to be happening so fast I didn't know what to do right now Yeah Who's gonna believe my story? Yeah, yeah. Who's gonna believe my story? The matter too long ago. The story too long ago. The matter too long ago. Uh, the story too heavy. It's lonely at the night. I didn't know what happened oh. It's lonely in the night I didn't know what happened It's story too long ago whoa, 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 What could I explain? Cause it's story too long ago How could I explain? Oh, I it's too long ago.